All right, if you just saw the video I made of the unboxing of the uh, Mess, uh, Mustool G600, um, then this is my follow-up video. It didn't take long uh, watching reviews of this thing to decide that I didn't like the sound of the click uh, when you press the face buttons, and I don't like the uh, force required to press the face buttons because it shakes the whole unit. And, uh, so I decided, uh, that I'd immediately take it apart, so you can see right here that there is a, uh, nice little hole in the side right where the seam is, and I've decided to, uh, wire, uh, directly to the interface board and build my own little breakout box. Um, I've duplicated five of the six face buttons. Um, and I'm using my left hand, it's on the left side, because I figure I'll be soldering with my right hand. So I thought, uh, hey, why not? And I even put softer buttons in there so they're easier to press, they don't make sound. And uh, it pretty much does everything that the uh, unit does with the uh, uh, built-in buttons, except now it does it uh, remotely. So, if you want to know how I did this, uh, you probably won't get me to tear it apart again. I'm just too lazy right now. Uh, unless enough people harass me, then I can open it up and I guess I'll show you. But uh, I hope you like this. Maybe, uh, maybe you'll think about trying this with yours. Uh, thanks for watching.